In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to clean the eyes. So I have Kylie with me and we can see that her eyes are not very nice looking. She's producing um, quite a bit of mess here. So what you want to do is you want to get your eye envy solution and some cotton balls. So, and I may need to clean her eyes twice because they are uh, quite weepy. So what you want to do is using the cotton ball, you want to saturate it with the INV solution. I have Kylie sitting on a towel so she doesn't slide around and I'm going to stand and put her body right up against mine so if she tries to back away, she can't. So what you can do is using your thumb and index finger, pull back the whiskers and hold your baby like that. And then using the cotton ball, start cleaning the eye in a sawing motion. Okay, so you can see what I'm doing there. And I'm just using a nice sawing motion to clean the eye and it's not hurting her. So what you wanna do is press firmly but gently. That's it, Kylie. And if you're not sure how far or how much to press, do this uh, against your own eyes. So you can see just with the first cotton ball how much debris came out. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that a second time. So using my INV solution, I'm gonna saturate it again with the cotton ball. And it's okay if a little bit of the solution gets in there, but... Okay, so what you see here is I'm wetting her eyes, a little bit of debris that fell right there. And what I'm doing here is I'm doing a sawing motion back and forth over the eye. I'm doing it actually a little bit more gently than I was when I was going over the bone. But right in here is typically where all the staining is, and so you can press a little bit more firmly in there, because that's it, Kylie, because there is a bone there. Okay, so as you can see that I'm just engaging in a sawing motion right there. And you want to make sure that you always use a second cotton ball for the, for the other eye. So there's no cross-contamination with any bacteria. Okay, there we go. So that's looking a lot better. Now I'm going to do the second eye. So again, I use my eye envy solution. Saturate that. And the second way is using your thumb and index finger. You can also pull it up. So you see that, I'll do that again. So you can either do it from below, just depending on how you're standing, or from above. So because Kylie's moved, I'm just gonna do it from above. So I'm gonna hold her face like that, pulling the ears and the whiskers back. And again, I'm gonna engage in a sign motion. You see what I'm doing there? It's just getting right into the groove where all the debris is. That's it, Kylie. That's it. And then again, across over the eye like that. And just make sure that as you're holding your baby down that you're not um, squeezing too hard around the face. So you see how much debris I got there? I'm just going to keep going a little bit more. And again, just going gently across the eye like that. Okay, so sometimes you may need to get a second cotton ball and do a second pass over each eye, but that's actually looking pretty good. After you've cleaned the eye with INV, get a tissue paper, and what you wanna do is you want to dry up the fur around the eye. So what I do is I take the tissue, wrap it around my finger like that, and then again in a sawing motion, going against the grain of the fur. That's it, Kylie. Just rubbing in to make sure that the fur is nice and dry. So you see, got a little bit more debris. Use a different part of the tissue for the second eye. And do the same thing. You want to make sure that the fur is nice and dry because if it's wet, that's where you're going to get um, the bacteria and yeast building up. There we go. And that's looking a lot better. Okay, and that's how you clean the eyes.